If you're tired of missing out on the latest releases, you have come to the right place. Today we're going over the top 10 best sites to keep you up to date on all the releases coming out. From exclusive releases to insider tips, don't worry, I got you covered. So sit back, relax, get your notepad, and let's get into it. First up, I gotta go with my old faithful, and that's gonna be House of Heat. I've been using them for a long time, and as you guys see, when we do the monthly release updates when it comes to the Jordan drops, that's the website that I go to every single time to get all the information on what shoes are coming out this month what the release dates are and all the updates if they ever have any date changes as well and you can also follow them on instagram or other social platforms to stay in tune with what they have going on but when it comes to blogs in particular this is definitely going to be one of the websites that i love to go to and i check each and every month we're also going to be talking about other apps free apps paid apps and other social media profiles that i think you guys should be following on instagram and twitter so make sure you guys stick around to the end of the video to see what those are oh yeah and if you didn't know by now my name is dj and this is the dna show hey! all right so taking it to blog number two i'm going to show you guys three different blogs and i'm gonna have the other ones linked down below in the description for you but the second blog is going to be nice kicks as you can see from their website they have a ton of different sneakers that they like to talk about now you know me here over on the channel i love to talk about the nikes and the jordans so when it comes to those models in particular i'm definitely going to be able to stay in tune with all the releases what's going on and any other news in the sneaker world nice kicks has been around for a long time and i'm telling you right now i don't see them going anywhere anytime soon we have seen them do collaborations and other special models and drops over the years as well definitely stay tuned to them because they always have some type of cool collaboration going on hey yo just real quick i wanted to let you guys know we got a bunch of new merch on the website shopdnashow.com also you guys can click on any of the links of the product tag just below the video here if you're watching on your mobile devices i can't wait to see you guys rocking the gear whenever you cop something make sure you post it on ig so i can see it and then i'll repost it all right let's get back to the video next up on the list is going to be another tried and true blog and that's going to be complex sneakers now they have complex the magazine and then they also have a special category for sneakers just like they have other categories for sports and music and different things like that so in that niche of sneakers trust me when i tell you when you go to the app you're going to see a ton of different options when it comes to varieties of brands releases and information and all the stuff that's going on with the actual release calendar and things like that and i can definitely say that complex sneakers is another place that i'm checking out new releases each and every month as well now taking it to the category of the apps i'm going to show you guys a few different apps that i like to use personally that's in my daily rotation and number one is going to be sneakers app now i know it sounds pretty obvious but a lot of people still don't know about sneakers app so we have to make sure that we mention it in today's video sneakers app is a nike app and it is a free app to have the app but then you have to pay retail price when you purchase the shoes. Now on the app, they do shock drops, they do special informations on there, they do behind the scenes information, and then also they show the release calendar for the shoes, but they don't like to show too far out. You're gonna see more information on the blogs when it comes to that aspect, and on Sneakers app, they only like to show maybe the next three to five releases that are coming, especially when it comes to the Jordans. They don't want people to start looking too far ahead and then not worry about consuming the product that they already currently have. Have on the app so i understand the strategy when it comes to their business but at the same time this is going to be a place that you can definitely easily stay tuned to the app push the notification button be able to enter into the draws be able to enter into the raffles be able to purchase the shoe that morning so for me like i said it's a great place and an easy resource to be able to stay up to date and then also purchase the shoes for retail now another free option like that when it comes to downloading the app for free you're going to have adidas confirmed so similar to the process like you have on Nike, you're gonna have the same thing for the Adidas Confirmed app. And it's essentially all gonna be the same kind of concept. You go on there, you can see updates when it comes to releases, you can purchase releases on there. They're gonna have different information on whatever it may be behind the story of the shoe or whatever's going on. So when it comes to Adidas, this is also gonna be a very identical process. Now, another free app that I personally love to use as well and stay up to date, especially when they have these special unique drops, and that's actually the GOAT app. On this app, it is technically a resale app, but they do have information on releases, what's coming out, the set calendar for the month, for the week, all the different daily releases, and you'll see all that information there. And sometimes they do GOAT exclusive releases like we've seen in the past with the Oregon Duck PEs, the Air Force Ones, the Dunks, the Air Max Ones, the other Air Force Ones, the Blazers, the Air Jordan 8. All the information for those drops was given on that specific app, and you're actually able to purchase the shoes from that specific app. So so for me, I like to stay tuned to see what's going on, especially because I love the Oregon Ducks and I like to get those PEs and it just makes sense.
Oh yeah, real quick, just wanted to let you guys know, I built a full checklist for you guys to help stay on your game when it comes to branding and sneaker knowledge. The link is gonna be down below in the description. You can download that whenever you want and you can use it each and every month. Let's get back to the video. Okay, now when it comes to the paid apps, we're gonna have the J23 app. This app has been around for so long and I have had it for so long. It's a great app because it sends post notifications to your phone and allows you to know if there's a shock drop, if there's a restock, if there's a new update on a special release, if there's a pushback on a release date, if something got pushed up, if there's a new shoe that just got debuted to the world, whatever it may be, they like to send you those notifications and it just keeps you update and in tune. Especially, like I said, for the Jordan lovers, this is gonna be a place for you to stay in tune with all the exclusive Jordan releases and the other cities and different things like that where you can get the shoes. And again, getting those notifications on your phone is very, very key i personally don't like to have that many notifications on my phone but one thing i can say is the j23 app i always have the notifications turned on whether i may or may not want to see that specific notification i guarantee you sometimes i have come up on some really good shoes because of those notifications now the next app is going to be soul retriever i have been using them for i would say probably about like four years now and it's a very convenient app as well you can go on their website you can go on the app and you can also get post notifications see what's going going on and they give you updates on shock drops and different things like that so sometimes i do get those dual notifications from both apps sending me hey there's a shock drop it's actually kind of funny to see which one beats which one to the punch sometimes because sometimes soul retriever beats j23 and sometimes j23 beats soul retriever when i get those notifications and that split moment right there is what will cause you to get the shoe or not get the shoe so for me i prefer having both of the apps both of the notifications on my phone to increase my odds and my chances when it comes to trying to get that pair of shoes or sending that link to somebody else that's trying to get that pair of shoes that they wanted now this app I heard it was free, but I'm not sure because I'm pretty sure you still pay and I think there's like a subscription within there. I think it's like a $4.99 subscription monthly, but there's a lot of other features. It's cool because you can enter into other raffles around the entire world at other stores that are doing global releases that allow you to purchase their shoes from their store. So if it's like in London or something like that, you can enter from the app on there. And if you hit, they'll just charge your card and send you the shoes from a different country as well if you're trying to enter on those. So for me, I like that aspect and I've seen a lot of people use it. And next thing you know, you got four or five pairs of off-whites coming to your front door. Like I tell everybody, I personally love it. I've been using it for about four or five years now and I think it's well worth it. Okay. now. Now, when it comes to social media, this is gonna be a place that I think you gotta stay tapped in. You're already on there, you're scrolling, you're doing all the different things. You gotta be following the right profiles at the same time too. So when it comes to Instagram, here's gonna be a few of my favorites that I personally like to follow for my page. Z Sneakerhead, shout out to my boy. He's always staying up to date and keeping everybody on the early drops when it comes to the new releases, uh, potential future releases, color renditions, and things that are potentially coming out. You name it, he's gonna always have you up to date with what's going on. The next one's gonna be Complex Sneakers. Like I talked about their blog, you need to follow them on Instagram too. They keep a lot of stuff up to date on there and they like to repost me a lot on there. So, you know, I gotta, I gotta show them some love. And the third one also, BR Kicks. Now remember, Bleacher Report, they used to be on other stuff and then they got into kicks as well, sports, you name it. This is a great opportunity to get tapped in with the sneakers and see what's going on. There's like basketball shoes and then like lifestyle basketball shoes. So staying up to date and in tune with those type of things is always good to have that access to and just seeing it when you're scrolling and stuff, for sure, three good options. And we got some more stuff tagged down below in the description. Now, when it comes to Twitter, this is like a hidden gem when it comes to honestly any niche around the world like twitter is just a low-key space where you can just come in and get a lot of information and get what you need and meet the right people and get in the right communities and those type of things me personally i suck at twitter i don't be on it that often but i still know some good spots to follow so these are going to be three good options for you guys sneakers stock so like snkrs just like sneakers app it's going to be sneakers stock so this is going to keep you up to date on all the shoes that are coming out how many pairs that are going to be available what your odds are going to be sending you information on shock drops different things like that and you can also turn on post notifications from twitter to get that information directly to your phone that way you can stay up to date and then obviously you'll build a community with other people that you can chat with and do things like that so the next one's going to be sneaker twitter now this one right here same concept 
you're gonna be able to get post notifications, do those type of things if you do follow it that way. If not, you'll be able to follow it and stay up to date with what's going on. See a lot of reposts, a lot of information, and it's kind of dope when you see a shoe come out and everybody hit, and then you get to post your got em screen within the thread and everybody's going off and they all got their pair. So it's a dope community aspect as well. And I think another great way to stay in tune with what's going on and then build community and build network in the shoe world as well. All right, you guys, you made it this far into the video and I'm excited to help you guys as much as I can. And again, hit the links down below in the description if you want to stay on your game and get the ultimate sneaker guide for branding and knowledge. It'll all be down below in the description. And if you want to see any other videos like this on my channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and I'll see you in another one. I would never let you down. Yo, if you made it to the end of this video and want to take your collection to the next level, I built a full community with private meetups with me and other members in the community as well. So if you want to be a part of that and get early access or behind the scene looks on how I run my businesses, this is definitely going to be a place where I can help you scale your collection and potentially start investing in other things outside of sneakers like real estate so hit the link down below in the description and get signed up and i'll see you guys on the inside that's in my dna hey, the hey, only choice i like to make what i'm aware it's today one one i would one never one. let you down that's in my dna the only choice i like to make what i'm aware today i was made for it it's in the dna